There are two ways to set a property on multiple selected objects at once in Blender. And the good thing is, it also works in the sequence editor. It works with strips. In this example, I have three pictures and they're not visible because their opacity is set to zero. If I want to set all three strips to an opacity of one all at once. For this, I'm going to select all three of them. You can see the third one, the last one, has a slight white border around it, meaning it's active and the time cursor is on the first one. Let's change the opacity and see what happens. Press N to open the properties panel and click and drag on the opacity to increase it up to one. You can see the first picture doesn't appear on the preview. The reason is when you modify a property, it only changes on the active selected object. So if I click and go to the third picture, it's visible on the screen. Now, from there, we can apply the change to all other selected strips by right clicking on the property and you select copy to select it. Click this and you will see the two other pictures appear on the screen. Now I'm gonna set everything back to zero, copy to selected, so they're all invisible again, to talk about the second approach. It's very simple. You click to set the property, you enter whatever you'd like, and instead of just pressing enter, which would set it on the active object only, you press alt enter, and it's going to modify all selected items. So you can do this with anything, any property you can see in there. For example, the channel, I'll press five and then alt enter and all three strips move up one channel. The good thing about this is you can apply modifiers to all selected strips at once by doing this, either by copying them, there's even a button uh, in this case, but you can modify properties this way. Another use case is everything that has to do with positioning text, everything you cannot move with the VSC transform, like this interactively on the screen, that's quite useful. 